Taking a picture is something we all take for granted, but being able to capture light and save it is a pretty recent invention. Back in the day, photos were taken on photographic film coated in a thin layer of silver crystals that react to light. Literally, each photo was a chemical reaction between the film's emulsion and light. But before you could see your photos, you had to develop them. Here's a fun way to develop black and white film using mostly stuff I already had at home. First, I'm gonna add one and a half teaspoons of vitamin C powder to 600 mils of water, 10 teaspoons of instant coffee, and about seven teaspoons of washing powder, AKA sodium carbonate. Mix it all up and there we go. That's our developer. Now this is a light proof developing tank and the film is inside. We're gonna go ahead and put our developer in. Stirring for a minute and then about three times a minute for about 11 minutes. Then we rinse. Now the fixer, or sodium thiosulfate. Its job is to wash away all the silver that didn't react to light and stop the negative from fading. Here we go. Wow, look at the results. Now, if you look up into the night sky, you might notice a few stars. While it might not seem like it, those stars are moving very, very slowly, or rather, we are. A great way to show off Earth's rotation is to take super long exposures of the night sky, sometimes called star trails. And that's what Kayla and I are here to try. All right, we're gonna start with a 20 second exposure. Here we go. So not much movement in the stars, but let's do a 10 minute exposure. Here we go. There we go. See, now it's a bit easier to see how we're spinning around. See that center point, that's where the South Pole is, where the Earth spins around, its axis. And I reckon it deserves a spot in the pool room. This isn't a pool room. 